so we seen that in order to prevent poisoning we need to follow the first aid steps that is keep medicines away from the reach of children and the medicines that have crossed the expiry date needs to be thrown out naphthalene balls should not be kept around when small children are at home and the next is in case of poisoning the victim needs to vomit and taken to the doctor immediately the next is talking about fire safety fire causes huge loss and damage to our life and property so what are the common causes of fire are the first is accidents and carelessness while burning matchsticks cooking and so on so this is the common cause of fire that is accidents and carelessness while burning matchsticks cooking and so on the next point is faulty electrical wiring and defects in electrical appliances so the second point is faulty electrical wiring and defects in electrical appliances so fire safety needs to be taken care of so we see that fire causes huge loss of loss and damage to our life and property and what are the common causes of fire so first point is accidents and carelessness in burning matchsticks cooking and so on the second point is faulty electrical wiring and defects in electrical appliances so these are all the common causes of fire so today we seen about the first aid that needs to be given in case of burns whether it is minor severe or chemical burns then in case of fracture in case of cuts and scratches next moving on to animal bites so animals like cats dogs and rats their saliva carries a deadly disease so carries germs of a deadly disease called rabies and the major symptom of rabies is hydrophobia a pe person having hydrophobia is afraid of water moving on to the next is first aid in case of snake bite then talking about the fire safety and moving on to preventing poison so these are the safety and first aid steps that needs to be taken in case of all these that is burns cuts and scratches bites poisoning fire etc